हेलो स्टूडेंट्स टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस क्वेश्चन आंसर्स ऑफ क्लास टेंथ साइंस वीकली टेस्ट सीरीज सिक्स अवर फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन इज वाई शुड कर्ड एंड सोर सबस्टांसिस नॉट बी कैप्ट एन ब्रास एंड कॉपर वेसल्स इट्स आंसर इज कर्ड एंड अदर सोर सबस्टांसिस contain acids therefore when they are kept in brass and copper vessels the metal reacts with the acid to liberate hydrogen gas and harmful products thereby spoiling the food our next question is why do ionic compounds have high melting points its answer is ionic compounds are closely packed structures made up of ions of opposite charges cations and anions the large amount of intermolecular force of attraction lead to strong ionic bonds a large amount of energy is needed to overcome these forces that is why the melting point of ionic compounds is very high our next question is what are the two properties of carbon which lead to the huge number of carbon compounds we see around us so the two properties of carbon are number 1 catenation it is the ability to form bonds with other atoms of carbon second tetravalency with the valency of 4 carbon is capable of bonding with four other atoms our next question is what happens at the synapse between two neurons its answer is a synapse is the gap between the two neurons at synapse the electrical signals are converted into chemicals that can easily cross over the gap and pass on to the next neurons where they again convert into electrical signals our next question is what are fossils what do they tell us about the process of evolution fossils are the remains of organisms that once existed on earth they represent the ancestors of plants and animals that are alive today they provide evidence of evolution by revealing the characteristics of the past organism and the changes that have occurred in these organisms to give rise to the present organisms so students these were question answers of our weekly test series 6 hope all of you have understood all these question answers so thanks for watching our video